2310 divide 2 is 1155, so that's it's going to be times 2. And if I divide this one by, definitely goes doesn't go into 2. If I try 3, it goes in 385, so I can multiply by 3. And then if I divide by 5, I get 77, so times 5. And then 77 is, of course, 7 times 11. And those are the prime factors, which just happen to be the first five prime numbers. 2 divide 4, I get a 2 on the bottom. 5x on the top and 5 to the 2x on the bottom. So that's 5 to the x over 2 times 5 to the x, 5 to the x. That's one way to do it. Cancel these out, and we're left with 1 over 2 times 5 to the x. That's not 10 to the x. 3 to the 3x on the top and 3 squared on the bottom. So that's 3 to the 3x minus 2. That's as far as we can go. And the next one, 4.2 divide 1.1 is 3.8. Whoops, 3.8 times 10 to the negative 2. Moving on. If I turn this one into a 3, sorry, into a 6. So if I turn that one into a 6, then I need to move this uh, 3 times over. So that's 0.0022 times 10 to the 6th. And then the original 3.4 times 10 to the 6th. So 3.4 minus 0 0.0022 is 3.39. That's four decimal places I have here. So I'm allowed to have four here. So that's 3.3978 times 10 to the 6. 243 divide, let's say 4. No, 4 is not going to go. Let's go. Uh, 9, that's 27, so that's root 9 times root 9 again times root 3, and 108 divide 3 is 36, so we have plus root 36 and a root 3, so root 9 times root 9 is just 9, root 3 plus 6 root 3, which is 15 root 3. And the next one, 288. Let's go divide uh, 9. We get 32. So root 9 times 32 is root um, 4 times root eight, which is root four times root two, divided by root 72, which is root nine times root eight, which is root four times root two. So those go, those go, those go, root four is two.